Hi, Dory. Mike Pliese coming at you live from Prime Motor Cars, Prime Mercedes down here in Scarborough, Maine. I um, know you're coming from Mass, inquiring on a couple of the GLEs as well as the 2020 GLC. The one uh, that you inquired about um, that we have online uh, is in current loaner service. So, I, I, unfortunately, I didn't have that exact one to show you, uh, and that's Selenite Gray. However, do have a 2020 GLC here with those Y wheels. Brand new wheels for 2020. So, same wheels on uh, the selenite gray one that we do have in loaner service um, beautiful multi-beam led lights reads kind of cascading over those um, in the bit once we wrap around i'll show you that selenite gray i have a brand new 2020 glc uh, in the coupe variant so i'll kind of show you that color what it looks like on on the 4k video which is nice um, it has the saddle brown uh, with that open pour brown wood on this one uh, in particularly I, I don't know exactly what was on uh, the selenite gray interior off the top of my head, but um, I know it was a little different. I think it could have been just black for all I know. Um, pretty much same space between the 2019s and the 2020s. Um, you know, it's essentially the, the same same cabin space, cabin volume, but uh, the biggest change you're going to see, Reed's going to pop in there, and I'll show you when we get inside that touchscreen. 10.25 inch touchscreen, MBUX. Uh, that's the user experience now. Touch buttons on the steering wheel. A little bit of changes for the interior buttons uh, and also that haptic touchpad, that feedback touchpad, which is which is really, really neat. So um, and I'll I'll have I'll have read really quickly. Here's the coupe in black, and I thought, yeah, this is maybe pretend yeah, 2020 right here in this in the selenite. So at least you get a color, just what, what it looks like maybe on video, might maybe a little bit different in in the pictures. You should get that same color. A little bit different wheel setup. Also a new wheel for 2020 on those. Beautiful Pirelli Scorpion all-season tires. Really, really nice. So uh, we'll hop in this GLC. We'll go for a little ride around the uh, dealership. All right, Dory. So here we are inside the cabin of the uh, the GLC. So um, I love to, to point out the touchscreen. Obviously, um, Mercedes uh, clientele. <laughs> and as I say, the M word there. Uh, that MBUX system does come up to play. So I, I did want to maybe showcase um, at least how easy it is to, to change the radio station. The biggest gripe with the multimedia uh, functionality and the voice control for all the, the previous Mercedes is that it was very, very lunky. Uh, you had to speak very slowly, enunciate every single syllable. Uh, with this new technology and, and uh, just three words, I believe it's called, um, is the software, uh, the kind of the intelligence backing this system. Um, makes it very easy to use and to talk to and navigate the system. So I'll, I'll just show you real quick. We have uh, classic vinyl on Sirius XM. So, um, hey Mercedes. How may I help you? Change to 80s on 8. So just like that, uh, changes to that, that Sirius uh, uh, radio station. Uh, there's just such a slew of things that you can do. Change, turn on the air conditioner, turn on the heat, um, open the sunroof. Reed's going to show you big, beautiful panoramic roof in this too, and I, I believe that was on the other one as well. So big pane of glass, lets in a lot of natu natural light. I also love to showcase the backup camera, just the high resolution, um, and then the easy uh, availability to do that concave, that wide screen look. So you can really see what's on all angles of, of your back, and uh, we'll hit drive, and that'll come off in just a second. So nice heads-up display on this one as well. Um, the the two-liter four-cylinder turbo is just really really nice really smooth plenty of power plenty of pickup plenty of horsepower great amount of torque coming from that turbo um, so it gives you it gives you just a, a ton of pep just a, a you know a, a lot of a lot of great mid-range torque mid-range horsepower as well but you don't you don't have to suffer on the uh, gas mileage like the old naturally aspirated six very similar power uh, of the old six cylinder uh, that would be in the C class or potentially a GLK or something of that nature, something similar to this, this drive line. So um, I really can't say enough about, about this new model. It just it floats on the road, really, really nice. Um, what I'll do is I'll, I'll send this off to you. I'll have Reed uh, edit the video real quick, get it on a YouTube link. We'll send it out your way and then um, maybe work on some pricing on, on the GLEs and the GLCs uh, comparatively, and, and we'll go from there. Um, looking forward to hearing from you next, um, Tori, and, and uh, we'll, we'll talk to you soon. Uh, thank you so much. Take care.